Today we're going to talk about nucleic acids. Uh, as we talked about in DNA, nucleic acids make up nucleotides and are part of DNA and RNA. Examples of uh, nucleic acids are DNA and RNA. Remember how we talked about DNA as being a double helix, as two strands. RNA is a single helix, and it's just one strand. A couple different types of RNA, mRNA, tRNA, rRNA. Uh, all three serve different purposes and different functions in the cell. Nucleic acids are made of a couple of different types of elements. Carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen are standard three for our macromolecules, as well as nitrogen and phosphorus. Um, each nucleotide, uh, nucleic acid is made of a sugar, deoxyribose in DNA, or ribose in RNA, as well as a phosphate group and nitrogen base. The nitrogen bases, as you'll recall from the DNA unit for DNA, are adenine, thymine, guanine, and cytosine. And for RNA, adenine, thymine, guanine, and uracil. Excuse me, not thymine, your cell instead of uh, thymine. The monomer of a nucleic acid is a nucleotide. Nucleic acids are used in protein synthesis and to transfer genetic information. So the DNA is used as a template to make messenger RNA. That messenger RNA during transcription and translation moves out into the cytoplasm in order to meet with the ribosome. tRNA molecules bring amino acids to the, cyto uh, to the ribosome to connect amino acids in order to make a protein. So DNA is used in protein synthesis, and RNA is used in uh, transferring the genetic information. That's the basis for nucleic acids, a little bit of review from DNA unit, uh, but nucleic acid is another type of macromolecules.